Hello everybody! This is Carol from Friendly Quail. Thanks for being with me today. Thanks for visiting my channel. If you're a subscriber, thank you for coming back. If you're not a subscriber yet, I hope you will be. Uh, okay, today I'm working on my um, botanical journal from a thrift store. And here are my signatures, and I put pockets in a bunch of them in my last video, or two videos ago, because I had the subscriber winner video. Uh, by the way, Charity, it's in the mail. Uh, I did send you a tracking number. Okay, but I was thinking I needed some journal cards and um, tags and uh, I've been trying to use things I already have made in this journal instead of making things to go in it specifically. So I found a master board that I made a couple of years ago and I cut it up. Now I made it a, a long time ago. It was before I actually was making videos. So that's quite a few years ago. So I've got a bunch of things in here that are going to go in here. And I do have to sew on them after I finish them up. But I'm gonna, going to, uh, not going to, I'm such a bad speaker. I am going to show you what's going on and finish up whatever I need to finish up on these. I did work on them um the other day without having the camera on so I kind of have written down like where things go so this one I had a tag already and I just am using that in there and that was when I was using strips up and I mod podged them on and I just put the little green ribbon on the top of that one and then I have this. So I need three things for this. I have three pockets. So I've got these three things. This one is going to go in the back pocket, but it needs um, a topper, some kind of a topper. This is the, one of the little ones. It's like a tag, so it needs a topper. And then I made just a journal card. So those... Are what I'm going to work on first. Move this out of the way. Okay, so this one, whoop, I got some something coming undone here. My uh, what was glued on is coming off. Yeah, I made this a long time ago, and I think I used, um, what do you call it, glue stick. But the glue stick that I used to use doesn't last. That was UD. I, I wouldn't, I, w I don't use that anymore. I use this Create, this one stays. But I got a feeling I probably use UD to, to do that, or not UD, Yoohoo. Beauty is my bread. <laughs> my um, gluten-free bread. Okay, and I did back all these with paper, like tea-dyed paper. This one, everything was the background, but these, I added these. So that will just be stitched. Okay. And that'll go in, like, here. So we have kind of the blue matching the blue there. All right, um, this needs a topper and this needs a topper. So what do I want to do? I think I'm gonna put an eyelet in here. Let's see. Maybe a gold one. I'm making a video. Okay, did it again. Let's see. This is going to, this has a bigger hole. 
I'm going to line it up with where I want it. All right. But I can use my crocodile to set it. Which is here. from the bottom so I can catch that eyelet on the hole in here and squeeze okay I still can sew by that because I will be sewing and then I'll I think I'll put a piece of either green or yellow ribbon in there um let's see I have a big bin. I'm going to just kind of pull it out. Ugh. All this stuff is like extra um, things I had left over and that type of thing. So I might put a, a lace topper on this one. And then I'll sew over it when I sew. So this will be, you know, like you do for a tab or something. It'll be different. I think that'll look nice. All right. And I'm going to use, whoops, my right on there. With my Fabri-Tac. And then I'll sew around there. So we'll have A lace topper on that one. So this one will be going in here. I'm not going to push it down all the way. This will be in here. This will be in here. And this is a floating pocket. So then that will be in inside of where is it? Here. It will be inside of here. Like this. I'm going to take those out until I get to sew around them. And I have a note to remind myself where they go. All right. Next. Oops, I just knocked down. I knocked down. I'm making a, a lampshade. A new lampshade. You can't probably see it very well, but I'm making that for a living room lamp, and I just knocked it down. I have to go to the store and buy some liner for it. Okay, this one, this already had one, and the only other pocket in here is this gate. And I shoved a piece of fabric in here, but I thought this would make a nice tag to go in here as well so what do i i think because of where it is i'm just going to put an eyelet um looks like this is coming up a little bit so i got to repair that um i put some uh, botanical dyed. I just put this on here. I had some of these on my master board. I don't remember if this one was on there or if I added it 
to this. But I am going to put an eyelet in here. And I want it down far enough that I can stitch past it. Um, let's see here. of these bronze ones in here. Yeah, because it kind of goes over here, so that's good. All right. I like the little ones that go over here. The little rings, the little washers or whatever you call them. Is it in there? Yeah. Nope, maybe not. I have it upside down. That's why. There we go. I have to turn it so that the, the the bar part goes through through the hole. And then that'll be up in here with a ribbon. So I will put that in my lit pile to stitch. All right. Now, here's one I made as a journal card. And this had this on it, I think. And this was on it. It's just paper. And I, because I had put some of these on. So this one will, I backed it with some uh, eco dyed paper that it was kind of a, a watercolor paper. And this was uh, from a white pine tree that was in there. So let's see, where does this one go? And do I need to do anything else? That is going to go into here. And I'm just going to stitch around it. I rounded the corners. So I'm done with that one. And then this one. Signature four. Oh, that's going to go in this pocket right here. And again, I added this on top of it. Actually, it goes this way because the butterfly is like this. So I I had this all was part of the the um, regular paper, and but then I added this on top of it, and that will go in here. And again, I just need to stitch. So I'll put that in my folder. Okay, this one. Is oh, and I did cut this down to go on that one. Okay, signature five. I have a vellum, this one, and I have some paper in here, but I'm going to put this also in here. And this needed something extra on it. And I didn't like this lady's head necessarily, so I kind of want to cover that up. So I think it's going to go about right there. So I am going to use this. And put some glue. There we go. Again, this is, uh, I believe it's Tim Holtz. Let's switch it up a little bit here. Okay. These I had bought in, in an antique store. I had bought some notebooks that a farmer had kept, and some of this paper was from 
from those notebooks. Now this one probably needs um it's a topper, but I think I'm going to use uh, a whale tail. And I have those somewhere. Mm -hmm. I've got too much stuff around, laying around. Oh, here they are. I have some there cut out that I had bought before I had a whale tail punch. That's kind of neat. It has a B on it. I will grunge it up. So today, I went to the dentist and got a crown put on that I had gotten it prepared for a while ago. I was supposed to get it put on last week, and I went, and then their machine, their compressor wasn't working, and she couldn't use any of her tools. So I was very happy to get that on instead of the temporary one. That'll be good. Um... All I've been doing is, is going, driving to doctor appointments with, like, my husband. He got his eye, had an eye appointment. He's going to have cataract surgery. So he had to get his eyes dilated. Then he can't drive. So I went, took him, and drove home. And then he had to go to physical therapy, and he still couldn't see. So I drove him there. And then yesterday he went in for an appointment for his back. He was getting MRI results. And so I went to that with him, not because I needed to drive, but he wanted me there. That'll be good. This will go in here. And I don't think I need, you know, I think it'll stick out far enough that we can grab it easy enough. So that'll be good. And... He's feeling a bit overwhelmed because he, um, let's see, this, this one's going to go in here. This has a rose in it, and it's going to have this tag in it. Um, no, what do I want to put on there? I think I might put an eyelet, and then that way I can put a pink ribbon or something in there. So I'll use this one again. This has a quarter inch. It's harder to figure out where I'm going, but it it makes the eyelet um, easier to put in. If I use my crocodile, my eyelets are a little bit bigger. And then I can't get the the pieces in it unless I make it bigger with an awl or something so it just works easier to use this one which pops it right on I think that'll be pretty if it has um, some ribbon it might stick out the top okay I got it the right direction Got it inside there. Okay. There we go. And that'll go into my pile for sewing. All right. And let's see. Oh, this page, instead of putting it in as a signature, I glued it in as a pocket. So it, I put a tab on here so you open it up, but there's a pocket right here. And I'm, I've am i got a um, card, journal card. I added this, and I added this. 
so that you can it'll stick out and you can pull that out and um, that all only has to have sewing done to it so that'll be going in there all right Hmm. It has that in it. I have this just laying here and I'm trying to figure out where it's for. I know it's for somewhere. Um, we'll see. But it's another one I made and this was already on it and I added this. And I know it's for something that I'm going in but I gotta figure out where. Okay. This one here has this one that goes in here. It's always down on that side. That was, I added this little flower and I added this to make it a little, to fit in with this. So that's going in there. And that's it for that one. I'll have to figure out where that goes. I know it goes in somewhere in here, but it wasn't in. Okay, this one I had already made. I will put some little pieces of ephemera in there. Oh, no. Let's see. This is for the tuxedo pocket. I added this. I had to cut it down a little bit, and I added this so that it would stick out of the top, and it would be easier to pull in. And then this is going to go in here, a journal card. And um, I, it, this was on there already. I added a little bird stamp to that one. And I have to stitch around it. So that will go on the pile. Let's see here. Oh. Okay. This is the flower pocket that I made. And these two are going to go in here. This one had this on, but I added the butterfly. And this one, I added these flowers. And that's going to go down here. So I know I have somewhere where this one goes, but it's not. Oops, i got a loose thing here. Sewing would fix that, but don't want it loose. I left it open. Again, the glue stick didn't hold. Everything else seems okay. But I will be stitching that. So this one will be here. And this one here. Okay, so this has to be for somewhere else that I had forgotten that I needed a pocket or something. I'll have to find it. But this one I did add this and this. This was already on it. it has some of that writing from the farmer. Um, I don't want to cover this up necessarily, but so I think I'll put um I'll just put a a uh, eyelet in there. Okay. And I'll go down. So I guess we'll see where that is when I'm doing the flip through because I am just about ready.
to sew the signatures together. I, I, there's like a rounded side. I like to have the rounded side up. I'm not sure if it makes a difference, but I think it does. There we go. Okay. So all I have left to do is get the um, ribbons and things or twine or whatever I'm going to put in uh, in there and um, that's it. I have to take these other ones back out. I left them in there. I have to sew them. So thanks for being with me today. Um, moving right along here and I will see you in my next video. Thanks for being with me. Love you guys. Do something today that makes you happy. Do something you love and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.